I paid my lawyer $10,000 to learn this so you don't have to. And the information I'm about to share with you can easily save you over $20,000 or more. And chances are you're probably making this mistake. So most people have a will and when they pass away, they leave their kids as a beneficiary to their homes. But this right here is the worst thing that you can do and here's why. Now most people don't know this, but when you pass away, your house is gonna go through probate and they can take up to as much as 4% of the house's value. So let's say your house is worth $950,000. That means they can take as much as $38,000 out of your pocket. Here's what you should do instead. Put your house into a revocable living trust and then put your kids as a beneficiary. So that way the house transfers to them without having to go through probate. And the best part is by using this method, you can also use what's called a step up in cost basis. So let's say the original purchase price for this house was $500,000. And the new value of the house when you pass is $950,000. So the kids decide to sell the house for $950,000 and they're left with $450,000 in tax free money. If you found this video helpful, make sure to save this video and comment the word more. And if we get to 10,000 comments,